In the city of his birth, mourners chant Grand Ayatollah Montezeri's name. Hundreds have taken to the streets in Najafad, and tonight opposition leaders urge their supporters to attend Montezeri's funeral in the city of Qum tomorrow. Riot police are already on patrol there, according to one website. The Grand Ayatollah died last night, aged 87. Large crowds have gathered outside his home in Qum. And in Tehran, video showed hundreds of university students gathering to mourn him. They say green Iran is in mourning, a reference to the main opposition movement. Montezeri was a fierce critic of the Iranian leadership, which he described as a dictatorship. He denounced June's disputed presidential elections as fraudulent and in August said the handling of the ensuing unrest could lead to the fall of the regime. In an interview with Channel 4 News in 2006, he criticised Mahmoud Ahmadinejad's human rights record. It makes me laugh when I hear that the president says that we respect human rights in Iran. It is a joke. When they even deprive me of my rights, how can I believe that they respect other people's rights? Montezeri was an architect of the 1979 Islamic Revolution. He was once considered a leader in waiting, but later spent five years under house arrest after falling out with the clerical leadership. His death coincides with rising tensions in the Islamic Republic, with the Shia festival of Ashura later this month, another likely flashpoint.